What's going on guys, it's your boy CMB. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, smash that like button, and let's get into this one really quickly. Now guys, uh, once again, we're talking about Floyd Money Mayweather Jr. and Javante Tank Davis. Now about seven days ago guys, uh, Floyd posted uh, something on his Instagram and I wanna read it to you guys. Uh, it goes, I'm at a point in my life where I need peace and tranquility not attitudes and arguments. Now, like I said, he posted that about seven days ago. And you guys know a few days ago, Javante uh, posted something on his Instagram, a uh, meme of Floyd Money Mayweather, uh, t taking a dig at him. Uh, I think he was responding also to somebody in the comment section about him being signed to Mayweather Promotions. And he responded, uh, I'm paraphrasing here though, guys, uh, that he wasn't signed to anyone. And... I was just putting two and two together and Floyd posting that seven days ago leads me to believe that, you know, there's something that was going on uh, behind the scenes as of late. And that's why Javante Tank Davis uh, posted that that picture of Floyd uh, that I would say <laughs> disrespect being disrespectful to Floyd and. He took it down. You guys know Javante doesn't leave anything up. He always takes it down, whether it be on Instagram or Twitter. He takes his tweets down. And I'm feeling, I feel what Floyd has to say in that post. Uh, because as you get older, guys, you, you tend to not want to deal with a lot of drama. Uh, you don't want to argue with people. You want to live a, a peaceful life. Uh, you want to make your life as stress-free as possible. Now, like I said, I'm, I'm not privy to what's going on behind the scenes, so I don't know, you know, what they're beefing about. And Javante, in my eyes, I think he's a, you know, he's a brilliant athlete. I think he has a big future ahead of him. But as the old saying goes, guys, uh, I believe you should never bite the hand that feeds you. And I'm sure you guys heard that, you know, that saying before, never bite the hand that feeds you. Uh, never burn bridges because you don't know when you have to cross that bridge again you just never know and i see a lot of young people doing that burning bridges uh biting the hand that feeds them you see it a lot of times uh, kids in the household with their parents you know they don't think their parents know anything or everybody knows more than their parents but nobody's going to take care of you but your parents they're going to feed you uh, they're going to clothe you they're you know they're going to do the the things the necessary things you know that you need nobody else is going to do that for you and, and it happens a lot and it looks like that in this situation uh floyd made javante tank davis the star that he is today and, and that's not saying that javante tank davis wasn't talented but having that name, that Mayweather name behind you, backing you, definitely catapulted him ahead of a lot of these other fighters out there. And uh, Floyd put him on the McGregor undercard, which got a lot of eyes on Javante Tank Davis. Uh, Floyd worked with Javante in the ring, giving him tips, giving him tricks. Floyd went to the fight supporting Javante Tank Davis. Floyd was telling everybody Javante Tank Davis is the next big thing. And... Uh, you know, he really had high hopes for Javante Tank Davis. He's done everything that he said he was going to do when it came to Tank. That's obvious. And now you have Tank disrespecting Floyd, uh, putting out these memes uh, about Floyd Mayweather, uh, amongst other things. We, we've seen other things as well. And I just don't think it's a good look. I don't think that arguing... Uh, with, with a guy that's helped you get to the, the spot that you're in, uh, you know, disrespecting him is the way to go. If you guys have issues, I think they should handle it internally, you know, talk it out. You know, men can talk things out. I, it's, I don't understand why in this day and age that, you know, if we have problems with one another, we can't sit down and talk it out and, and come to some type of uh, truce or, or, or peace between each other. And it's just it's just a bad look, in my opinion. And, and not to say that, you know, I'm I'm harping on Javante Tank Davis. I'm just speaking from an older person's point of view, uh, somebody that's, you know, trying to put you on. And and, and he's done it. He's put Javante Tank Davis on. Uh, never burn your bridges. Never burn your bridges. Like I said, you just don't know when you have to cross him again. So, like I said, I do feel... Floyd Money Mayweather Jr. in that post. 
Uh, not saying that, you know, Javante doesn't have any gripes against Floyd. Maybe Floyd did some stuff, you know, that Javante can't, you know, get past. But that's what sitting down and talking things out is for, in my opinion. So uh, you guys let me know what you think uh, about Floyd, that post he made seven days ago on his Instagram. Are you feeling that? Uh, do you think Javante Tank Davis is doing the right thing by, you know, poking fun at you know floyd and putting up memes and, and saying derogatory things uh or do you think he should handle it you know behind the scenes uh with floyd himself uh you guys let me know in the comment section it's the cmb i'll talk to you guys in the next one and i'm out peace